So my wife and I packed uh, two horses and went up into the back country to a pretty secret alpine lake. I've been there one other time before and she's been up there with her family a few times growing up. But this was our first time really just doing it on her own horseback overnight. Just making sure the horse ain't too spooky. Ready to go. We didn't bring a pack horse, we just had everything in our backpacks or some of the bigger stuff strapped to the tops of the saddles. Seemed to do okay. Since we're only going in for one night, we really didn't have too much. It was about a five mile, maybe like five and a quarter mile ride one way. It's, it does occasionally. Oh, there's a bear track. That was cool. Build up a lot more muscle no, <laughs> definitely not. <laughs> this last part is all right. All right, a little bit more. Come on. Oh man, that thing is sparkling. Okay, all right, we gotta go under this branch. Right here. I think it's right here. Come on. It's just rocks. <laughs> like, 
There you go. Oh man. Oops. Beautiful. Oh. Trying to video and catch fish. Awesome. That's a nice one. Fishy! Oh, it's gonna make its way down there. It's it. There he goes. We caught so many fish. I probably had a fish on every cast for the first 20, maybe even more casts. size they are. Here's the fish we cooked up that night. Did I get it for you or you got it? Oop, you just killed it. <laughs> I didn't kill it. <laughs> Nice, babe. I'm stuck. Itty bitty. Dakota, she's just tuckered out. There's the Aries ready to fly. We keep going like nothing ever happened. It's because I didn't slap it. <laughs> Need help, honey?
I put the hoodie on and it immediately stops blowing. And the sun comes out. And the sun comes out. That's a pretty neat place to make a fire. I'm surprised these shoes even have any grip left. Now here's the following morning. Pretty windy, pretty cold. But we had enough fuel to make some hot coffee and hot tea. So here I was filling up my reservoir bag for my water filter so we can cook and have some hot tea or something, coffee. Really doesn't get much better than this. Took the horses to the water to drink up because they haven't hardly drank the entire trip, but they actually wanted to eat more than drink. Eh. Oh, he didn't break it. He's a fat one. Look at that. Oh, we should figure out what's inside of him. Look at that. Oh, yeah. The one I ate yesterday had that. He's a big one. That's a keeper. <laughs> oh, yeah. And freak out. Oh, he didn't freak out. Okay, catch one. <laughs> oh. What's going on? Oh. <laughs> oh, he wants it so bad. I can see him. You got him. Woo, he's a nice one. That's a nice one. That's a big one.
I love that one. Booyah. Quinn and I just limited out for the day and I caught one I ate yesterday and we still had a whole bunch more that we caught yesterday that we let go and today. We're gonna be eating good tonight. <laughs> So here's my gravity system for right now. Here's Quinn's water bladder, which is the same one I use. The Sawyer squeeze with their adapter that you gotta buy separately. And the C knock or knock, whatever, outdoors squeeze bag. Two liters there, two liters here. Um, doing it kind of like G drops a, a second, which is really, really slow. This thing is about a year old. Sure what's going on why it's so slow this time but I did test it at home and it was pretty quick last year and I never used it since so I figured it was still in good shape and something happened and it's not really filtering very fast by now this whole bag should be done but uh, it is faster now than it was this morning might have to just wash it out a few times but I'm going into the backcountry here next week and I'm just not gonna trust that for Five, five days or so, maybe more, in the back country. So I'm probably gonna have to buy a new one. But yeah, that's where we're at. Got all packed up for the most part. Clint and I both got Glocks. Both got Mr. Ranch packs. Got two horses, Morgan and Half Morgan. And yeah, then Quinn's over there cleaning some fish. Or fly rod and my spinning rod. We did not make a fire here, but we did in those rocks today. Just to kind of try to get out of the wind a little bit. And here is my wife. Slinging guts left and right. <laughs> <sighs> Beautiful. All right, getting ready to head out. Drying out my feet. Last minute water filtering. This part was pretty steep, so instead of riding the horses down, we got off and walked them down for maybe about a quarter mile, half mile. So it was safer for all four of us this way. It's really hard to show how steep something is on video. The big one. <laughs> you need to you need to loosen your straps, honey. You should be able to do this. 
No, the, the, the shoulder straps. You got a butterfly friend. Oh, yeah.